New in Eclectic IQ's Intelligence Center version 3.4 is a visualization and analysis tool for intelligence labeled with MITRE ATT&CK techniques. Many sources of intelligence now provide ATT&CK techniques as common metadata, describing the techniques used by a given threat such as a threat actor or malware. This gives analysts a common framework with which to fingerprint individual threats, compare different threats on common ground, and enabling trend analysis across larger datasets. Within the Eclectic IQ platform, this allows us to visualize the technique information for one or many threats together. The feature goes beyond simply visualizing techniques, providing analysts with a suite of tools for filtering, annotation, and knowledge-based curation. In this video, we'll walk through the feature's capabilities. Here, we have the attack metadata for a single entity, in this case, the actor APT41. For each technique, we can apply and view annotations, enabling users to provide crucial context for what is otherwise a fixed taxonomy. Analysts can also save these views to a library for future access, and to support the curation of a knowledge base for their organization. Opening up another saved layer, this time we're viewing the techniques for LokiBot, a malware that targets Android devices. The attack analysis feature supports the latest version of MITRE's attack framework, version 15.1. Support also includes all available matrices, covering enterprise, mobile, and ICS techniques, supporting analysts working with intelligence across all three disciplines. The tool provides additional filters for hiding empty techniques, adjusting visual options, and modifying the scoring behavior for larger datasets. Moving to the search view of the platform, we have filtered for all intelligence which has attack technique metadata. From this search, we can select one or several entities and visualize them in the attack analysis feature. When visualizing multiple entities together, the results are presented as a heat map, clearly identifying a trend across the selected intelligence. Every technique offers a drill down capability, highlighting the subset of entities for a given technique and providing all of the supporting information available from the attack framework including links to the official resources for more information and related sub-techniques. This view also provides information on mitigations and detections, allowing analysts to quickly pivot from intelligence to techniques to mitigation and detection options, all without leaving their intelligence platform. Next, we'll create a threat actor entity to add our own attack classifications to the intelligence center. All intelligence collected by the platform, whether through automated actions or manually, is processed for attack technique IDs so that they can be extracted and added as labels to the entity. We've added a description here containing several attack technique IDs to be extracted. With the entity saved, we can view the result. Each technique ID in the text has been extracted. We can now see those listed as metadata, and we can access the built-in classification tool again to make any changes we need to. As we saw in previous examples, from this entity's context menu or from the search, we can now choose Add to Attack Analysis to bring this entity into the visualization tool for further annotation and visualizing the techniques in the matrix style. That concludes the demonstration of the Attack Analysis feature and its capabilities. Thank you for your time and attention. If you'd like to know more about Eclectic IQ's software or services, you'll find more information available on our website. To see more of the platform, you can find more video content like this on our YouTube channel, or reach out to us directly to explore the solution further. Thank you.